Hi guys, I'm Jen. I'm a videographer, a photographer, and an editor. Today's video, I'm going to show you how to open Premiere Pro and start a timeline. To get started, we're going to click on Premiere Pro and it is going to pop up. And the first thing that you're going to do is you're going to start a new project. I'm going to go up here and I'm going to title this test. Let's just say test one. Okay. And then I'm going to come down here and I'm going to say create. And this entire blank canvas shows up. So what you're going to do in order to start a timeline, go up to file, new, sequence. And you're gonna click on sequence and then this window is gonna pop up. You're gonna title your project test one. For editing mode, I'm gonna pick custom. For my timeline, I am going to stay with 23.976 because I like to always edit on a 24 frames per second timeline. For my frame size, I am going to put 1920 by 1080. This is going to be horizontal. I'm going to keep it at square pixels 1.0 there. I'm going to keep this the same. I'm going to keep this the same. I am going to keep this the same rec 709 and then here same thing audio is going to stay the same all of this gonna is going to stay the same again we have named it test one and we are going to now click ok and we'll see what happens super exciting you have created your first sequence this is horizontal and now i'm going to show you how to create a vertical sequence we're gonna do the same thing, and the only thing we're gonna change is the size. So we are going to click on this window here, see how it pops up blue, it's highlighted in blue. We're gonna go up to File, New Sequence. I'm gonna name this sequence Test 2. And then what I'm going to do is I'm gonna go up to Settings, and in order to change the frame size from horizontal to vertical for me is to just reverse these numbers. I'm going to do 1080 by 1920. I've got my sequence name, test two. Everything else is staying the same. And I am gonna click okay. All right guys, I hope that has helped. Thank you so much and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.